What's up guys, Gapo here with another Minecraft chess routes video. This is on the map Rebellion's District. It is by Sanders and this was a map that was released and brought into MC Gamer two or three weeks ago. So I just want to get a chess route onto this since some of you guys were wanting to have one. So basically there will be two routes. One which is the overworld you could say. And another one, which is like the underworld, like the underground bunker of District 13. So I'm just going to start off with the overworld, and then we'll get down to the bunker, whatever you can call it, underworld. So let's begin. <laughs> Alright, so to begin on the overworld here, you will want to go in the east direction. Now, in this route, m mostly there will be a lot of tier 1s, so I will unfortunately not be able to cover all of them. Like this one right here is going to be a tier 1. So I'm most likely going to go through almost like all of the tier 2s, since there's a lot of tier 1s like over here. So in this house, you'll find your first tier 1. Now you just want to go back down here and come towards the side, run up these vines, jump up the tree, and then you'll be on top of this house and actually stay on this tree because you'll need to parkour onto this hill weird thing and come up to here where you'll find another tier 2. Now just keep on going down this hill until you see this building. Now you're going to take this nice leap of faith into the building and come on through here break the glass uh, gr uh, grass leaves same thing no same difference and you'll find another tier two now you just want to let's see how can we get out of here all right come out of here like this and once you're at the ground you'll find another tier one and if you break this leaf right here and these leaves you'll find another tier two now you just want to keep on going until you get to these houses, another tier 1 right here. Come all the way to the end and parkour your way up here and keep running and parkour on these fences and you'll find another tier 1. You can drop down and find another, oh my bad, sorry that's a tier 2. You can drop down and find another tier 1 and go up this hill and Oh, you don't even need to break it. There'll be tier 2 right there. Now you just want to roll down this hill, jump into the water, and once you're here, you'll find this nice looking button. You want to press that, and uh, I'm going to break that for now. And you'll find another tier 2 in here. Don't know what that button does, actually, unless it's the way out. Yeah, it's the way out, my bad. And um, you just open this here, and you come outside the water. And to finalize the last tier 2 of this overworld route, come up the stairs to here, go up this ladder, and your last tier 2 of this route will be right here. So now I'm going to go on and review the second route, which will be basically the underground part of this map. Alright, so this is the bottom underground part of the route, and... Basically, what you will have to do is go facing the west direction, pick up this quick tier 1, and just come on down here. You'll find many tier 1s scattered along here, like one there, and just drop on down over here, and if I can find it, should be... Ooh, it's getting tricky. Right here. You'll find a tier 2 right here, and it might take some little bit fancy parkouring but after that you want to come on down to this ladder go up because over here you will find another tier 2 now after you find that tier 2 you can go up these stairs all the way up here and press this lever and it'll open up this thing and you'll find another tier 2, tier 1 right there now now we're going to go to this other direction uh, you can go up this ladder and where is it? here? okay yeah you can go here and 
drop on down, climb up this ladder, and let me actually try and like do this. Oh, uh, okay, yeah. You have to jump here. Watch where you're going. See, I didn't watch where I was going, but you need to like make sure where you're going, and you need to do one final leap of faith. And another tier two is going to be right there when you jump down tier one. And there's actually this nice trap right here. Whatever you do, there's a tier two in there, but it's that wooden button, and then there's a trap chest inside, which um, puts lava in the room, and there's no way out, I believe, so not sure about that. Now you want to come back, oh, no, come back over here, and some nice, easy ladder parkour. Make your way up here, tier two, break the leaves, however you want, just make sure you run all the way down here. It's a bit of a run, and once you're over here, another tier two. And now the final place is here. Alright, this is my bad, but you do not actually want to go up these stairs. And this is the wrong staircase that I chose. I'm really sorry about that. Um, you want to actually stay here. So once you're running down here, instead of going all the way there, you're saving some time. Tier 1, you want to go up these stairs. And you want to go up these stairs again. Another tier 1. And now go all the way here to another tier 1, many tier 1s down here, and go all the way here until you see this ladder, go up this ladder, go up these stairs, and you'll find a tier 2, and then you want to go up these ladders, or no, you don't want to go up these ladders, you want to just keep on going down here, all the way down, and you'll find a hidden tier 2 right there, and that sums up the bottom underworld bunker part of this map. Alright guys, so that ends the chest routes video for Rebellion's District. We've come to an end with the overall chest route having 8 tier 2s and over 10 tier 1s. And with the underground bunker route with 7 tier 2s and over 10 tier 1s. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this Minecraft chest routes video for the MC Gamer Network. If you want more videos like these, comment down which maps you want me to make a video on. Leave a like if you want to see more videos like this. And subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you guys all next time. Ta-ta.